Once again, we find ourselves on the open road, taking a little road trip today. One of my most favorite things ever to do, and it's exactly what we need to shake up the day, shake up the week, as a nice little road trip. And we're going somewhere special today, oh yeah. Somewhere very, very special to my heart. Bucky! There it is, right outside my back window. Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back. I am Chris the Girl. This is another episode of the Spooky Shopping Channel. And as you saw, we uh, we went on a little road trip today. Spooky Channel, Spooky Shopping Channel road trip. We are actually in Daytona, Florida because this is the closest closest area where there is a Bucky's. This is my quote unquote local Bucky's. Um, and my local, I mean seriously hours and hours away from where I live, but nonetheless, it is for now, for now, the closest Bucky's to where I live. Anyway, we are gonna go inside of there because I got wind that there is Halloween finally at Bucky's. Big, huge, gigantic shout out to the most wonderful people on the face of the planet. Mark Muncy, Carrie Schultz with Erie, Florida. I'll put the link to all of their amazing, wonderful stuff down below. Um, if you like the spooky things, if you like cryptids, if you like all of like ghost stories, like all the stuff, all the good stuff, um, you're going to want to check them out. They do everything from books to podcasts to, to everything. Anyway, shout out to them because they clued me in. They let me know yesterday that Bucky's has Halloween out. Now, they did not go to this particular Bucky's here in Daytona. It was a different Bucky's. But I'm kind of hoping that this is going to be kind of like a, like a Cracker Barrel, um, Bath and Body Works sort of thing where when one store puts it out, the rest of the stores put it out like it's a like it's a all at one time sort of thing um so that's what i'm hoping for today we traveled very far to get here so if they don't have halloween uh well hey we're at bucky's and guess what i adore love 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 bucky's um so it's not too much of a wasted trip we'll you know we'll get the beaver nuggets and all the snacks but anyway there should be halloween in there i'm so dang excited Without further ado, let's get on in there. It looks busy, 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 bumping, ha, huh, as Bucky's usually are. So this will be a journey as it always is, but I'm excited nonetheless. Hopefully you are too. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Without further ado, happy Halloween and let's get shopping. Let's go. So if you aren't familiar with what a Bucky's is, it is essentially like the greatest gas station on the face of the planet. And gas station really is, it's, that's just the beginning of it, okay? Bucky's is ginormous. They are huge. They have snacks, they have food, they have all the normal like gas station stuff and then some. It is it, and merchandise, like it is a journey in there, folks. It is a journey. If you've never been inside of a Bucky's before, just just wait and see. Of course, we gotta say hi to Bucky. Hi, Bucky. I'm ready to see Halloween now. And just as I suspected, it is very, very, very busy in here. But check it out. We do indeed have Halloween. Look at that. Halloween shirts. I do love Bucky shirts. They are always so cute. If you've got it, haunt it. So this is the back of the shirt there. There's Bucky, Vampire Bucky, with all of his pumpkins. So cute. And then this is the front of the shirt here. Bucky on a bunch of pumpkins. Love the bats on there. It is super, super cute. And the shirts are $18. Also, they got uh, Halloween tumblers. Look at that. They glow in the dark too. Oh dang, these are good. These are really cool. I love the bats, the spider webs. Wow, that is, okay, that is awesome. These are $20. They're also huge as well, I might add. Wow, that is a winner. Okay, I've got things to think about apparently. These are also super adorable. Looks like you put these on top of bottles. Like they have a, a little example there with the wine bottles. But it's like a little vampire cape. It's got Bucky there, of course. And then on the back, Batty for Bucky's. We sure are. That is, that is not a false statement. 
Let's see, it is five dollars. Halloween coloring and activity book. Okay, that would be fun. All that is adorable. Yeah, look at all that. Great activity for the kiddos, especially if you're on a if you're on a road trip there. That is super fun, super adorable, $4. And oh my goodness, a six foot inflatable Bucky. Look at him in his little costume. He lights up, self inflates, stakes included. How adorable. He is $60. I have no idea if our neighborhood would allow him. We do live in an HOA, so I'm a little nervous about getting some inflatables, but dang. If I, if I knew for positive that we could have one, I would be buying this, hands down. He is so cute. And we've got, of course, hair bows. They always do hair bows as well. These are usually for the youth, but hey, I would rock a Bucky's Halloween hair bow. This one's $8, this big one here. And then this little one is usually, I think, meant for like infants or babies, you know? And it is $10. We got some socks in here too. There's little socks, again with uh, the haunted house there and Bucky and his costume. These ones are six dollars, and then they have long ones. Oh, these, yeah. There's a uh, there's kid ones, and then there's adult ones here. So the adult ones are eight dollars, and there is a scrunchie as well. How cute is that? So this one is six dollars. Here's another version of the sock here. This one's like a purple one and it's got okay, Bucky on the, uh, on the pumpkins. The yeah, it is crazy, 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 crazy busy in here. The food section is always the busiest part. But yeah, you can just see here, get a, a decent idea of what Bucky's is all about. And yeah, they have, so they have like merchandise over in this section too. Like usually a bunch of like, I don't know what to call it really, like cottage, country, farmhouse sort of decor items. Usually some pretty cute stuff. All right, so we've got a whole section in here with a bunch of fall Halloween items. There's some really, really cute things in here. Hand soap, autumn harvest hand soap, lotion. I don't think this chicken rub is part of it, but that is kind of scary for me. There are some candles in here too. Cardamom pomad pomad pomander pomander. Hello. Okay. Copper leaves. Ooh, ghosty bath bombs. That's adorable. This one is fifteen dollars. Oh, and there's a a jack o' lantern one here too. Very cute. And they have these like pumpkin fragrance warmer things here. So you put like the wax melts on them and then they it smells all good there's a photo there of what it would look like these ones are 20 20 dollars we got a hello pumpkin hello as well that is really cute let's see here so this one is 30 dollars for that this is interesting i'm not even really sure what it is but it says smell it don't eat it trust us on this hang it up in your car closet or locker but don't leave it where it will stain because apparently it will melt. So I guess it's just kind of like a good smelling thing. I don't know, it's adorable though. It's $9. And these are super cute. These like little manicure sets here inside of this little jack-o'-lantern. There's uh, some nail polish in there as well as like the stuff that you put between your toes and a nail file. That is really cute. How much? Are ya? And holy moly, they want $20 for this thing. Okie dokie then. And they also have a haunted house version of it too. There's a ghost little dish cloth here, a little dish towel. This one is $13. Look how cute he is. All right, Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. Lots and lots of really cute little items in here. Now again, like this isn't necessarily, uh, there's no like Bucky's stamped all over this stuff. I basically showed you the Bucky's things that they have for Halloween. We might have missed a couple things. I'll definitely check the store. But this is like what I'm saying. It's kind of like that farmhouse, cottagey sort of feel. I'm not mad at it. It is very, very, very adorable. 
like this little uh, salt and pepper shaker set here. How cute is that? A little jack-o'-lantern, little ghosty, and it's twenty dollars. And and they're in this little wagon here. Super cute. Also, this is adorable. This uh, little jack-o'-lantern with a witch hat on it. It lights up. And this one is $13. This mug is also very adorable. I know a lot of people collect specific things, whether it's jack-o'-lanterns or ghosts or whatever it is. Um, and I think that's really adorable. This one's $17. It is really cute, this little ghost mug. This would be perfect if, if the ghosts are your jam. Really cute. And they also have a jack-o'-lantern one as well. This little set here is $21 and I think maybe, yeah, it's, it's got a little spoon and it's a little little dish. Also super cute. I wonder if you could put like maybe, I don't know, I don't know what you would use the little spoon for. Maybe if you put butter in the dish or, I honestly, I have no idea. If you have something like this and you use it on the daily, please let me know what the, the little spoons are for. I would love to know. Granted, these little spoons say ceramic ceramic candy scoops so I don't know what candy you need a spoon for to scoop it out with but I guess it exists it is ten dollars they got a candy corn one here there's a jack-o'-lantern one and a ghost these little ghosts are super adorable too little top comes off and he's like a little jar how adorable nineteen dollars for them it says it's a candy jar but truly you could use it for all kinds of all kinds of stuff. Also, these little dishes here, really adorable as well. These are $10, $10 each. Yeah, you can see what the like wide view here, kind of what, what they're going for, like the aesthetic that they're going for. I love it. I think it's adorable. I really, really do. I, I like all of it. I'm a fan. Look at the picture. Oh my gosh. The ghost. Oh, it's so cute. And the ghost picture is $45. And there's some cheese plates in here too. See, I know what that, I know what that utensil is for. That's for cutting the cheese, as they say, and not in a bad way. Really cute there. So they got the jack-o'-lanterns in there. And then there's a ghost with the jack-o'-lantern here. It comes with a little dish towel as well. And it looks like it's going for $25. This jack-o'-lantern ghost dish is really super cute too. This one is $35. I almost missed the, the mugs with the toppers on them. There's like a vintage cat and a jack-o'-lantern. These are going for $15. But this is the one that I really, really like. The witch hat, which I don't think I've seen in mug form before. Well, how cute is that and then there's also like a little witch feet one there too pick your poison cauldron mug that is fantastic that is ten dollars love me a good old fashioned cauldron mug there's also a raven i think this is a candle actually which is really nice that is six dollars pick your poison signs i think this is again something that you could like drape over a wine bottle or something like that these are three dollars and the skeleton bottle opener is also really adorable i've seen these out and about before it's thirteen dollars they are always so cute someday i'm gonna invest in one for sure and they have these cute little headbands in here too thirteen dollars it's got like a spider on this one and then a witch witch feet on that one and, uh, I know all that's pretty cool. So that is $13, this animated doorbell thing here. Also, I see some ice cube trays, little ice molds, little skulls. These are $15. That's always a good thing to have. Happy Halloween sign here. Scuttle, the whole gang is all here made out of wood. And take a look at this. We totally saw this yesterday, or at least something very, very similar. This uh, spoon rest here with the golden skeleton hand, $10. It's different, but it's uh, it's basically the same thing. And they've got plates to match it, bowls as well, mugs. That's pretty cute. Very simple, but cute. We also have this set in here, which I like the bowls. I like the ravens on there. It says beware on it, these tiny bowls. 
eight dollars and they have tiny little uh tiny little plates too which pumpkin is always very very adorable twenty dollars for that oh and they do have a raven mug as well yeah i like that that one's eight dollars okay but i think i like this one a little bit better it's got a black cat and a skull lamp on there adorable it says spooky really cute little little plates it's got the mug and there's also this one here that says hocus pocus on it with all the same little features that's definitely like a dessert set you put your ice cream in there maybe a little slice of cake got your coffee oh yeah i'm there and this is really cute too this uh fuzzy pumpkin here is 30 dollars. he lights up he's got a fun little tassel on him too what's up witches that's right i said witches that's a cute pillow i like that and it is reversible as well oh and here's another set let's get wicked so yeah you got there's a bunch to choose from oh and the the fuzzy pumpkin comes in orange too that is adorable. Also, take a look at these. I think these are votives. Nine dollars. Those are really, really cool. I like the whole spooky setup they got there. I think this might be the last thing that I see on this particular Halloween island. It's a, it's a drink dispenser. Look how cool that is. You would be the coolest person at the party if you had this thing. Let's see. Don't break it. It is $45, it looks like. And here's what it looks like in the real. Kind of looks like a old-fashioned um, gas dispenser, like gas as in the stuff that you put in your car. That is really cool. I like that. Oh, you know what? I think that's totally what they're going for with it, too. That is neat. Yeah, that is really cool. Oh, my gosh, and look at this potholder. Oh, it's got dish towels in there. Oh, it's so darn cute. Looks like it is $13. And there's a pumpkin one here too. Cute, also $13. And it also has little dish towels inside of it as well. Well, that is just adorable. And it's got some kiddo clothes as well. As always, the youth gets the most awesome stuff. I like the fringe on this one. That's pretty cool. Candles, more candles. Ooh, dang, Bucky's. Okay, cool. I have to smell some of these. Beaver nuggets, candles, cinnamon roll, their house blend coffee, which I highly recommend. To roasted pecans and signature scent. I smelled all of them and they all smell amazing and they're twelve dollars okay it might be coming home with a bucky's candle spoiler alert found more halloween socks these ones are for the adults oh yeah i've got some really cute puppy dogs give me all the treats i like the color of that one a little baddie you're creeping me out focus focus i need wine to focus that is the opposite of how i feel Trick or treat, smell my feet. All right, got all the puns in here, $8. Yeah, I think these are probably all gonna be $8. Yep, $8. Let's go, ghouls. That's kind of hilarious. The ghost there with a cowboy hat, cowboy boots. There you go, maybe a little Shania Twain, $20. Mombi, I know a lot of moms out there can, uh can definitely feel that shirt twenty dollars here's a skeleton guy who's drinking some coffee says killing it twenty dollars life, life is spooky without jesus as well twenty twenty uh twenty dollars but again as i mentioned the youth gets all the best stuff like i really like this shirt happy halloween's got the bat on there I would totally wear that all right i popped out for a minute i'm gonna actually put my camera away i'm gonna grab stuff uh, i have a, a long list of things of snacks and stuff that i want to grab from bucky's while i'm here um so but yeah i'm gonna put my camera away because i'm gonna definitely need both hands for this endeavor holy moly i'm gonna need like 50 hands for this but anyway um i'll show you what i got uh in just a sec here i'm supposed to put my camera away and take a look they have an inflatable bucky right here how cute is he oh my gosh it is here bucky's is 
Bucky is here. Hi, Bucky. Alrighty, folks. We are done at Bucky's. First of all, I apologize for the wonky angle and if you move at all because I didn't bring my uh, tripod today. So yeah i'm making do but let me go ahead and show you all what i got now spoiler alert right up front here i did not get any of their halloween stuff um i personally i wasn't like a huge 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 fan of the shirts um they're adorable love them of course but i didn't love it enough to buy it um i think the one that they had last year was a lot better especially because it said like we're going spooky shopping or whatever it said. Um, I actually have the blankie um, of of that print uh, back at home. And speaking of blankies, no blankies. There weren't any Halloween blankies, so we may be too early for that. I don't know. Hopefully, they will bring those back because I was I would have totally would have bought a, a blankie, but. Um, that was not in the cards for today but anyway no halloween stuff didn't buy the inflatable sixty dollars if if the hoa doesn't allow inflatables then that's a waste of waste of sixty dollars so i i didn't i didn't buy it so anyway let me show you the snacks that i got because it's basically all snacks um these are staples of mine whenever i go to bucky's i always get these snacks first of all sweet and unsweet tea it's a half and half tea they have really really good tea um also got a little thing of cheese cubes because i love my cheese cubes and i did get the candle i went with the uh, house blend coffee candle i am now a fan of coffee candles they smell so dang good and i really love their house blend coffee i think it's really good and so i got some i got me a bag of coffee now i've been drinking mostly iced coffee lately because you know it's a thousand degrees outside but um i will definitely make an exception for some bucky's coffee bag of course of beaver nuggets as well this was a request by tampa j to grab a bag of beaver nugget nuggets so we just gotta eat them before they get stale these do get stale folks they, they don't they don't last forever trust me and this is something that i was super excited for their beaver chips basically potato chips house made potato chips these are so good this is my new favorite snack at bucky's actually not new ever since i had them like last year they've been my favorite snack so I get these every single time so 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 good I literally dream about them and then finally I got sour salt water taffy this was another request by Tampa J but again not complaining because this stuff is delicious if you ever go to Bucky's and you like taffy and you can like handle um, you know like chewy stuff oh my blob get these so good sour saltwater taffies i'm gonna have to try not to eat both of those things the beaver nuggets and the saltwater taffy all before tampa j gets home um but we will we will soldier on we will try and speaking of tampa j it's a bittersweet moment coming here to bucky's because you know he is so busy this season um it's haunt season now He's basically going to be gone almost every single weekend from now until October. And um, so sadly, he's not here with us today. Um, I always go to, but I've never been to Bucky's without Tampa J. This is the first time. And why does that make me want to cry? Oh, um, I guess because I love my fiance. What can I say? But um, Bucky's is like our thing. Um, it's become our thing together. So, wow, I didn't think that was going to make me cry. I'm not going to lie. It's not a Chris the Girl vlog if you don't cry. Um, anyway, um, miss you, Tampa J. <laughs> that was fun, but it wasn't as it wasn't as much fun. Anyway, we had a good time. They had Halloween. That's the important thing. And by the way, this video's coffee and/or Bucky's half and half tea is thanks to Rich. Thank you so much, Rich, for supporting the channel. Cheers. Hope you enjoy this one. Happy Halloween. Alrighty, folks. Well, that was short, sweet, and relatively to the point. Halloween is officially at Bucky's, and I am so excited about it. It is adorable as always. I love Bucky's 
so 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 dang much um and yeah this was just a just a really fun time brief trip um but honestly the the journey was the best part as well as the friends we made along the way um but yeah seriously love bucky's it was a fun time and um that took way shorter than i thought it would so i may go film another video because why the heck not i have the whole entire day in front of me and now i'm fueled up uh by bucky's so anyway i appreciate you all watching so much if you love the halloween decor shopping as well as fall we do a lot of that here on the channel as well as a heck of a lot of other stuff so if you want to subscribe and be a part of the channel and keep up to date on all the stuff all the halloween goodness and beyond i surely would appreciate it and also um if you want to give the video a thumbs up that helps me out a lot as well um so yeah i will see you all very very soon again thank you for watching happy halloween everybody Bye bye <laughs>